We'll make the mashed potatoes. Very good. It took six months to get you there, but very good. I'm Stefan Richter. Most people know me in America from Top Chef season five. I made it all the way to the end, got beat by Hosea. I'm actually known as the bad boy of restaurant business. Okay, I'm Take it, I'm only out of the way! Now, I have a fucking room here. Look at this fucking shithole. I'm originally from Finland. I didn't come to America 11 years ago with 60 bucks in my pocket to be a failure. Let the failure be somebody else. I'm not gonna be. Tomorrow I'm opening, Stefan's in Montana. The goal for this restaurant is to open it, mm. of course, make money. What's the point to open a restaurant don't make any money? Guys, this is Stefan's in Montana, it's my name. We're opening tomorrow. Uh, we have less than 24 hours. I cannot screw this up. See, the problem is what people do, they spend a lot of money. They want to rip out the sink and move to the other side. 15 grand, not worth it. Hey, uh, Alex. Yes? Should we put a picture up there on the wall? Leave it like it is, put a lot of makeup on it, lots of paint, that's the deal. Oh, here, look, we have the, DV uh, the, the DVR box. What's wrong with my pants? Your high heels, your high heels are too high for your eye waters. I'm Alexandra Doheny, and working for Stefan is probably one of the most amazing experiences I've had. A fun part of my day is when I catch Stefan driving up in the parking lot with all windows down, playing the air guitar, rocking out to Journey. Stefan's like stressed out, but I think the journey is one of his relaxation tools. Love journey. I want you to make grilled cheese sandwiches like this, look. Who, who, who is the f***ing American here? What's on a grilled cheese sandwich? What kind of cheese? American cheese. Here you go. I might be a little harsh with my staff sometimes, but there's not much margin for error in my world. And I'm gonna tell you the last time over there. No f***ing earrings. Just take him off, dude. You look like a hoodlum. Just take him off. Put him in pocket. Stefan definitely pushes us to the point of no return. And what is this? What? Hickey? That, look at it. Birthmark. A hickey. Hickeys, earrings, what? Songs? <laughs> well, my name is Leandro. I know Stefan for so long that we became great friends. This is a Carpaccio. I do have, you know, great respect for Stefan. Because bottom line is, he's the guy that teaches me how to cook. People call me chef because of him. One more thing, Stefan. I got this hummus. How does it taste? This way, go. Yummy. Oh, yeah? Who mm -hmm. made it? Who made it? You I fing made it. How about that? So I came in this morning, 6.45. Fat, grease, water, everywhere. And the smell was just absolutely insane. I have never smelled anything else before in my life. I'm somebody's me gag. So the deal is this a grease trap, this clock. It's just absolutely nasty. Oh, good morning. Hey. What's going on? Grease trap, it's a mess. I have staff coming in 20 minutes. It smells horrible in here. I just, I can't even believe this right now. She can come right and just pull right here. Awesome. It's good. When you open a restaurant, it's, it's never perfect. You should anticipate there's something going wrong. So you get a restaurant and it rains and pours. It starts little and it escalates and look what happened today. I'm regretting opening this place now. Just a bad freaking restaurant. You're kidding me, right? So we're getting to open and currently I cannot charge credit cards. So yeah, screwed. <laughs> okay, if anybody touches my fing stove one more time, everybody turns it down. Don't turn the shit down. Leave it. We're gonna open in about an hour and a half. We still can't use credit cards. The fish guy delivered the wrong fish. One guy got stuck on the freeway, his car is supposedly broke. So on the end, I'm kind of fing actually. Chicken breast in here, anyone? To get this organized right now. It's kind of hard because the Montana story is not the way it's supposed to be. All these things make you wonder why the f do this? Why did it open this business? Guys, everybody ready? He's gonna, I need to make some money because I'm broke. Just make sure we do a good service today. 
And open the doors now, let's go. Hey guys, we're officially open for business. First customers! So excited! Two for lunch today? Get a risotto going, cream with tomato, pasta, ravioli. Here we go. Lunch was great. I had the mussels, it was excellent. That's really good. We had the steak with the fries and it was awesome. Here, our shot 31. Yep. Take it up. It was a big journey to get here. Everything in this business is crazy. The front of the house, the back of the house, the prepping, the organizing, the grease traps, stupid people you hire. It doesn't matter what it is. It all ends up being a mess. It's a fing sh box. You know, it's Russian business. Okay, guys, lunch went well. Thank you. A couple little things to tweak. Food was okay, but it went out too slow. Too much bull going on. So let's get ready for uh, tomorrow. Get everything organized. Thank you very much. Goodbye now.